Today we can discuss about the duplicate detection rules. Means what is duplicate detection rule? Example, go to your model develop. So I have a names are JJ and Priya. So example, if the same name with the with the name of Priya, if I'm creating it, we don't know. It will it is now it will take. We can observe here. It has taken. So now two names is there with the with the same mobile number. So we need to find which you are, we need to find the duplicates. So that is the concept of duplicate detection tools. How to find duplicate detection tools? We can check. So go to uh, advanced settings from here. So click on setting. So we are having a data management so please observe here we are having a duplicate detection rules so click on here so already we will have inbuilt accounts with the same accounts table contacts table but ours is new custom table so click on new so give it as a then we can do like uh, our table name is employees, so we can do employee. So, so base record type. So now our record name is name. So now we need to select which entity. So employee details. To match the current employee details on it. So now I'm selecting the field. So click on select. So I need uh, we can first go with the name. So name criteria exact match means so I am giving example Priya. So it should come same name Priya. They are creating means it will show it is a duplicate. Same first characters means it will show PR is PR. If any regard is creating the PR means it will show all the duplicates. Mostly we will go with exact match because the first and last so many records will make up. So we will go with the exact match. So ignore blank values. No need. So now we have done with the name exact match. So we can save now. So the duplicate direction you can observe here. Employee, but we should change the name as employee. And one of the need to publish, then only it will reflect. No, now it has published. Now we can see here, we can publish here also. So now it is published. So now it go to your solution model level app. So okay, I'm creating the same name now. Now please observe here. It's showing duplicate record forms. We already have in with the name of Priya already two records. So if you want to save, you can ignore and save. Or else you can cancel and change name of the employee because what we are having so name like uh, last name right also, we can use that term. So I'm using ignore and save now. Automatically SIM card also created. Now we are having with the Three. So with the name, we have done the duplicate detection rule. In the same way, phone number, email, or whatever it is the field we want, we can do it using duplication detection rule. And thank you so much for watching.